Alrighty, hey, what's going on, guys? Neon here, and today we're back with. Our <coughs> I think it's like our third one that we're doing for this survival series thingy. Yeah, this is the third one. I know, I, I know some of the stuff looks incomplete around here. This is actually a backup that I did before I blew up the other world, the two worlds. <laughs> I had like three fucking backups, I know. Alright, so today we are going to be reviewing all the guns and stuff. Basically, this whole line of stuff we're going to be reviewing. <clears throat> so let's get right into it. Alright, so we're going to grab our key. Right, so we got a safe here, we can't open. Alright. We got the key to it here. We have an unbreakable lock. And this is a locksmith stable, so you can configure it to whatever key, you, like number you want. If you want to like open it, you can just use that too, the key imitation kit, and then you get two counterfeits. So uh, yeah, we're gonna go on with that. All right, so this is our uh, atomic science starter kit. <clears throat> so basically, this is all what you get in besides the keys down here. This is the Atomic Science Advanced Kit, which basically is like gas centrifuge, centrifuge ram, hexafluoride tanks, plutonium hexafluoride tank. This is for like refining like stuff for like fuel and um, what uh, what not. <laughs> Breeding reactors, so you could transform like scrabium to uh, <coughs> ethereum or whatever. The RTG furnace, nuclear reactor, Chernobyl style, so it's gonna fucking blow up. <coughs> RT generator, assembly machine, chemical plant for like getting like chemicals out of like oil and stuff. <laughs> Alloy furnace, so you, you could put the industrial grade in the steel, I think it is. Alright, so you're gonna get your uh, alloy, uh, throw this and this in here. Then you're gonna get a lava bucket. <clears throat> if I could spell right today. Oh, well, these actually look pretty sick, these things here. <clears throat> you get your lava bucket. Put it in there. Boom. Ah, oh, I think it's the Mac. What kind of uh, copper is it? Yeah, it's the Minecraft gray copper. My bad. How the fuck did I mess that up? So, yeah, it is the Minecraft gray copper, which means that is actually right. And from that, you get advanced alloy ingot. <laughs> I don't know how that makes any sense. And it a really nice green. It looks like it's winking at you. <clears throat> all right. Basically, all that stuff is in here. The atomic science kit for commercial uses. This is for like fuel rods and stuff. You get an iodine pill, which removes negative effects. Get rad X, rad away. Motors, RTD unit, breeding reactor, core. Look at all this fun stuff. <coughs> Storage blocks. Eight nuclear reactors. Hmm. What do these look like? So you could put them in like series like this. Ah, uh, that looks pretty Chernobylish to me. So yeah, that's that. Look at all these. Put your water and stuff in here. Probably a few rods in here, you grab you or something. You don't want to make, you don't want to make, let this get like run out of this. Or it's gonna blow its top. If it gets too hot, boom, <laughs> you're finished. Alright, this is the electronic engineer's kit. So you got all these radio engine pistons for this. <clears throat> you got your combustion engine, diesel generator. <clears throat> We got all of our kits in here from the mod. Every single one. Here's the uh, hazmat kit. We got regular one, advanced, high performance. Here's the missile kit. Here's all the mi missiles and stuff that comes in here, which are uh, I showcased in the other video, but that they're over there just in case we all forgot. We got a T45 power armor. I'm going to test this one out. Might wear this for the rest of the mod review. 
He went zero. All right, so yeah, you you probably need your fusion cores first. Look at that. So you get your fusion cores. Look at that. You're really running around now. And he's not really much faster. Actually, yeah, it is, it is faster. It gives you speed, too. Until the fusion cores run out. So that isn't too bad. <coughs> Where were we at? Alright, so we got the uh, grenade kit here. We're not going to test these out here yet because <coughs> I worked so hard to put this whole entire thing back together for the third time. Alright, so we got the uh, CMB steel, which I have no idea. I think you get it from those hunter chopper thingies, but I have no idea. You get scrap metal, CMB steel powder. So I think once you get it from that, you can like put it in the steel furnace. Okay. Like okay, let me see oh, let me see something here. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna go in game mode one here. So we're gonna get our shredder. We're gonna get a Scrabium Shredder Blade because just because that's like the most overpowered. I'm gonna put that down. Oh crap, we need two of these. All right. So I'm just gonna see if we can actually <coughs> take the uh, CMB scrap metal, smelt it down, like powderize it, get into that. Crap, that's not where that goes. All right, here we go. Here goes nothing. Listen to that. <coughs> okay, that does not work. How the fuck do you get the powder, though? All righty. Well, we'll figure it out in the next episode, probably. Hmm. All righty. So here's the uh, scrabium stuff. Here we got scrabium missile. Red coil capacitor. This is help aids in the transmutation. Using this, <coughs> don't want to lose that. Got their Ethereum here, which basically get it from like burnt out quad scrabium rod. You put this in like a crafting table or something, and boom, there you go. <coughs> you get like a little nugget like this. All right, so here we have all of our. Uh, guns and stuff so the right the revolvers are have actually changed a little bit so in order to like you see that little bar over there in the corner it says zero slash six you're gonna press R to reload it makes a little sound so that then you can reload All right so we're gonna look okay no I'm not gonna commit genocide against a horse <laughs> Okay, we're gonna some, uh, spawn an iron golem. It's not like he's gonna last anyway. Like, boom. Instant fatality. <laughs> this one's probably the most overpowered. And it does take out the durability, like, by 10% every time you use it. I'm gonna give it four more. I'm gonna switch back into game mode zero. This is basically a big iron. You see that? That took out two of them. When he tried to mash the ranger with the big iron. You see? So, when you get out of ammo, you just reload again. And boom, there you go. But it can't shoot through windows. Which is okay. I mean, can it? Okay, but I want to see this now. I want to see if it actually... I'm going to put an iron golem right here. And we're going to see if we can actually shoot through the window. Okay, you can actually... Ca oh, dear lord. That's not good. <coughs> actually shoot through windows. I don't like the sound of that. Just imagine you're in your base, mind your own business. All of a sudden, somebody shoots through the window. Hmm. There you go. Simple revolver. Look at all these. Got cursed. Ooh. 
That sounds ominous. All right, we got a rocket launcher. Ooh, 84. Do we have an 84 millimeter rocket or no? Nah? I don't think that's the right kind. Dang it. Alrighty. Well, we got the Stinger Rocket. Stinger Rocket. Basically, it zooms towards any. Oh, there we go. Very nice. We also got like shotguns and stuff, quadruple shotguns and buckshot. Oh, look at all of these freaking things. De depleted rain box. Ooh, this this one I really like. Just love. If you ever charge it though, you get blown up. So I want to do that. But yeah, you can shoot through everything. Get my girl in the Thank you. Boom. Dead. In an instant. Alrighty, let's move on. <clears throat> so the next thing we're reviewing. I mean, I'd show you all of these, but... Ah, what fun's that? What's orange? Okay. Well, we can show you, uh... The uh, Cryrelator. Which is from Fallout 4, actually. It's in Vault 111. And we're gonna show you the EPM Ray. Spark plug. Mm. Can't forget the HP laser jet. Antimatter launcher and the Fat Man. HP laser jet. Where is the freaking crap? I forgot the ink for it, didn't I? Oh, come on. How the frick did I forget the ink for it? The fucking printer. No, that's a thing. Alright, well, I forgot the ink to the laser. But this is basically what it does. Shoot it. Basically, instantly vaporizes stuff. Let's try the uh, spark plug. What the heck, yo? That's a lot of damn. Oh my god, look at that, yo. Try it again. Damn. <clears throat> Got a cryer later? Y'all need to chill the fuck out, yo. Basically freezes everything. Moliator. Hits me. Pretty much burns everything. If you don't hit snake, it's basically a flamethrower. Nothing special about the fire later. It just freezes every fucking thing. APM ray. So if you got a whole bunch of electronics. I don't know if I want to do this. Alright, so we're going to show off one of the wands here. Debug wand. Structure wand. I'm going to set to titanium factory. That works. Advanced factory. That's even better. There we go. I may need a nuclear reactor while we're at it. Boom. There we go. Got a nuclear reactor here. Now watch this. So you see how it's working now? You got UI and UI. Whatever. Boom. Hit it. It should it should have not destroyed it. Okay. Maybe this does not work. Hmm. Interesting. Well, that didn't work. Let's try a Watts reactor. Crap, I fucking hell. Alrighty, so we're gonna try a Watts reactor then. Just give me a second. Actually, no, we're gonna try the fusionary Watts reactor. I 
Fusion reactor. We're going to try the fusion reactor because that's the biggest. Alright, so we're going to shoot it. Boom! There you go. There you go. See? Fucks everything up. You're going to try the same thing with the fusionary loss reactor. Lost power plant. That's what it is. Whatever. Look at that nice building. Let's see if we can mess it up. Hit it. Did it damage anything? Did it damage any of the core components at all? Alrighty, so some of these are actually resistant to EPM rays, which is actually pretty cool. So if you got a uh, Watts power plant, then you're pretty good. Visionary, ooh, the big guy. Look, this really looks weird though. Okay, we're gonna try it against this. Ah, unfortunately, that is not resistant. So it only seems like the ones with the uh, like protective outer layer, like the. Uh, <clears throat> so basically, ones with concrete are resistant then. I think. Don't know if that's a glitch or not. Like, look at that. All right, EPM, EMP. What the fuck? Oh, we got buck. Oh, we got an EPM freaking <coughs> rockets and stuff. We got a lot of EPM stuff here. So we had an EPM charge. Hmm. Guess we don't. But yeah, there you go. Very nice. We reviewed the spark plug. All right, antimatter launcher. This little village guy going on there. Shame if something were to happen to it. Oh crap! It's not gonna make it. Boom! It has hit the floor. Give it about a couple minutes. I want to back up. When it goes, it goes. a lot of damage. Thought that was a lot of damage. Just wait till you see my little friend Big Papa. <laughs> see that little poor defenseless village over here? We're gonna aim nearby it anyway. Whoa! See that one was actually better. Okay. But dang, look that's a lot of damage. And now I got freaking poisoning. Ah, shoot. Alrighty. Read that part. Alrighty, let's get into the goodle and. Let me in! This always happens. There we go. Alright, so now we have all the bombs and stuff in here. Look at all these fun guys. Boom! We got grenade, enhanced grenade, frag grenade, shadow grenade, cluster bomb, signal flare, lightning bomb, poison grenade, grass grenade, jar of pink, jar of cloud, pink cloud, regular cloud, smart grenade, MIRV grenade, breaching grenade, even though it doesn't really breach or anything, digger grenade, Impulse grenade, plasma grenade, tau grenade, scrabium grenade, combustible lemon, tossable gas can, mark two, ambassador pineapple, <coughs> tossable scra anti scrabium cell, mark uh, six, drill grenade. <sighs> I'm not really good, and uh, black hole grenade. Look at all these grenades. All right. Let's start with the first six. So the first one we got is our regular garden variety grenade. Not very exciting if you ask me. Boom. Weak. Oh, come on. Even a creeper could blow up better than that. That's better. Look at that. That's a lot of damage. We're going to see that. We're going to try that again because there was a little hole in there beforehand. <coughs> 
Boom! Look at that. That's a lot of damage. Frag grenade. You're in for it now, buddy. Prepare to be. How did every one of those hit him? Miss him. It doesn't like really explode much. It just sets out a whole bunch of arrows. Come on, somebody hit him. Oh my god, y'all had an opportunity to hit him. Shrapnel grenade. Got some damage going on. Shrapnel grade really doesn't do much. Alright, cluster bomb. Surely you can't survive this. Boom! Oh, look at that. That's a lot of damage. Signal flare. You can see that from a while away. Look at that. Oh, freak you. Yeah. Lightning bomb. Watch this. Boom! Get wrecked, little villager. Poison grenade. Oh, see? So it's kind of like a mini, like, nuclear bomb then. <coughs> How are you not dying? So that's all of those. Not very exciting. Does a good job of ruining the ground for you. Oh my goodness, we almost walked past this. Is that a crashed spaceship? Holy go moly, it is. And over there, we got a, like a little dud or something. <coughs> Let me drop in. All right, so the next thing we got is our gas grenade. Basically, all these grenades. Branching grenade. Impulse grenade. Watch this. Doesn't really do anything too exciting. I have no idea what it actually does. Digger grenade. I'm gonna try it. Oh. Sure does dig, I'll tell you that. Branching grenade. <coughs> MIRV grenade. That's why you want to throw that one up. Give you a little rain. <laughs> Smart grenade, but is it really? Boom. See, it is smart if because if you throw it too close, look, look at this. It won't blow up, but if you throw it far enough away, so it thinks that you're not in danger, then it don't blow up, which is actually pretty cool. This is fuse the to impact. Alright, sharp pink cloud. Ooh, this one's not fun. Oh. Look at him succumbing to the poison. I can't get the effect because I'm in creative mood, but. Pretty sure I know I can. can. And boom, he's instantly dead. I don't know if it's just like generally poisonous or what. Cloud. Yep, instantly dead. Ugh. Looking like the Sierra Madre in here. Gas grenade. I think we already threw this one. Oh, this is all freaking lagged everything. I've done messed up. Oh shoot, yo. Okay, that was the poison grenade. I was really late. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of lagging, yo. Don't get too much blindness. Get a lot of everything else. But the the red cloud actually leaves some of this like weird uh, 
residue. <clears throat> they got a plasma grenade. Okay, well, I already set that off. Okay. Slight lag going on here. That basically burns you. Nothing too exciting. Yeah, it's, it's gonna be a lagging for a little bit now. What have I done? Gone out of my inventory, I say. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Okay, so the next... Oh my God. The next one we have is our tug grenade, scrabium, all these fun little things. We're saving these two for the last. Because one of them is going to crash my game. Alright, nuke grenade. Boom, he's over there. He's over there. Boom. And you pretty much get a lot of fallout. Mark 5, stick drill grenade. I don't know why I said Mark 5, it's Mark 6. And don't manifest it. Toss your anti scrabium cell In Bassner or Pineapple. What are you doing, bud? Boom. Not really that exciting. Tossable gas can. Great for all you pyromaniacs out there. Almost as fun as the... Oh, yo. We just found one of these. We found a freaking... We found a nuclear power station, guys. That's going to be our next episode, then. Right, anyway, that's our muscle lemon. I want. I don't really set that off too close to that, just in case like something bad were to happen, you know. It's awfully quiet. Oh shit! Oh, oh no. that always happens unless you have like a. One of those lovely uh, hazmat suits. Now we have the tall grenade. Boom. Instantly destroys whatever was bothering you. <coughs> if it's the negatively charged ions or whatever the fuck it is. Alrighty. So now we got the negative negative energy pair annihilation wow that took a long time to pronounce negative energy pair annihilation grenade that's a long name and we got the black hole grenade I know the black hole grenade is going to crash my game so we're just going to throw this one first sounds like a pogo stick <laughs> whatever oh you know how close that was to hit my thing yo Damn. I'm feeling a bit woozy. Now we're gonna. All oh right, so we're actually gonna show this one off now since we're here. But this is our uh, crashed spaceship. Got a lot of stuff in here. You just get tritanium cells, anti scrabium. Get some uh, neodymium power. <coughs> Dinium, whatever. Get a lot of advanced alloy. So if you're looking for this stuff, there's a whole crap ton of it here. And look how much we got. Not to mention this little kid over here. It usually gives you like some stuff like Asian origin stuff, mini nukes, rocket launchers. Get some masks. This is probably from like Metro 233 or something. It's from one of the metros anyway. I see. I only played Metro 233, so that's one of the, the one I associate with. All right, so now we're gonna throw our black hole grenade and watch as my game crashes because it always does. Watch, it's gonna crash. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe if you haven't. I'll see you guys next time. 
waiting. Okay, well, anyway, I was uh, actually really expecting it to crash. Like any other time, it's like, ooh. But anyway, look at how it's just tearing that apart, sucking all the blocks right into it. I'm gonna, let me get uh, some mobs put near it. Right, we gotta hurry up because it might be spawn. Oh, 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 nope. Whoa! Oh god, I've just been smashed by trees. That's not the only one you can get though. You could get like Neon Knight was spaghettified. <coughs> Let me get some of these. Oh, just kidding. Alrighty. Well, that's the end of this mod review. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. Tell me pretty lies, look me in the face, tell me that you love me, even if it's fake.